Alright, let's see if it will plug in. I just bought a new charger for it. Oh, look! Lights! I got lights on! Oh my god, this is crazy! What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So, whoops, don't drop it, Don. I just got it. Okay, so, what we got in front of us is a Toshiba masterpiece this is an early 2000 model i believe it's a 2002 model but this is a high-end model when this laptop was released it cost you twenty four hundred dollars the beginning models the models that didn't have the built-in dvd drive and stuff cost about two thousand dollars and then the ones that didn't have intel's extreme graphics in it were about nineteen about $1,900. Well, anyway, this one has Intel's Extreme 2 graphics, has a Celeron processor in it. It does have a DVD. See that? Isn't that crazy? A DVD CD-ROM driver in it. That's insane. Who who even has that anymore? I mean, it's crazy to think about that. Well, anyway, this laptop I found in this case, and I was thinking. I wonder if it works. So I bought the, the cell phone charger. So I bought a charger for it. And it works. It works great. Well, anyway, I want to tell you guys a couple things about it real fast. It has a 15 inch screen. All right. It's a mid size. It weighs about 6.7 pounds. It's a Toshiba. It has a 30 gigabyte hard drive. 30 gigs. Oh my god. 30 gig hard drive. Intel Celeron, 2. Point gigahertz. Uh, CPU has an L2 cache 256 kilobyte cache all right the bus speed for this thing is 400 megahertz it looks great I mean it's it has little to no use usually when you get these these are all black and worn out and the stickers are all faded this thing saw little to no use I can't believe that uh, the chipset in it is an Intel um, 852 852 GM that's the chipset in it uh, the bus speeds a 400 megahertz bus speed Wow the memory in it oh my god the memory is DDR it's 266 megahertz all right and then the most that you can have in it is 256 megabyte and it does have two uh, two chips or uh, two RAM slots in it so you can hold up to one gigabyte of total total memory one gig isn't that insane hang on there's like something in the way it won't sit flat there it goes okay how's that yeah that's better okay back to what I was saying this is a nicer a higher end model so it does come with a CD writer and a DVD ROM which I showed you guys that uh, max was one gig memory at 26 at 266 megahertz um, the screen the screens 15 inch it's a 24 bit 16.7 million color screen and I told you guys about the um, the, the graphics right the Intel extreme graphics well, anyway the graphics the memory for the graphics is 32 megabytes that's how much memory this thing has is 32 megabytes of memory for the graphics card that is crazy slow dude and just think this thing cost you like two grand back in like 2002 that's what's crazy about it uh, the battery on it so the recharge time is 2.6 hours and you get 3.2 hours of runtime. It does have, get this, a lithium ion battery. Isn't that crazy? It has a lithium ion battery, 4400 milliamp, which is the runtime of the battery. Uh, wow, look at that. Y'all remember that? AOL Online? Oh my god, it has Windows XP, Celeron. I just can't believe the, the, the shape of this thing. I mean, it looks like it was never used. I mean it was never used look the keys aren't wore out the stickers aren't bad uh, the speakers the speakers there aren't they aren't dented or anything like that that's crazy I'm gonna 
I'm gonna try firing it up here in just a second uh, let's see here it's 75 watt it has a phone line a modern phone line a microphone 10 slash 100 Ethernet and the Ethernet speed is 56 kbps which is extremely extremely slow so just to kind of recap Intel Celeron 2 gig 30 gigabyte hard drive the memory is 266 megahertz now our typical memory in our today's computers is 2400 or 2666 that what this isn't just crazy to think that this thing is using a fraction of that you know and it runs too that's what's crazy about it man and then you know i up to one gigabyte of memory <laughs> that's crazy let's see what happens if i turn this sucker on oh my god it actually came on oh what's that say battery is low or cmos checksum is inconsistent press the f1 key okay F1 key. <gasps> wow, it took me into the BIOS. What? Oh my god, look at that. What's that say? Space disk, change values, change pages, exit without saving, home default. I've never I've never used a, uh, a, a BIOS like this before. This is really cool. Battery save mode, full power. Password, not registered. Well, that's good. Total memory. 524,288 kilobytes. Jesus. Version 1.2. I bet it needs an update. Boot priority CD FM ROM to LAN. Built in HDD to PC card. Network boot protocol. Power on. Power up mode. Enable. Huh. Well, um, I don't know. I want to touch it, but it's, it's not a touch screen. I don't know. Do I use this? Let's see here. It's on date and time. Uh, full power. Let's see here. Can I? Let's see. I'm over here. Alarm options. Level 2 cache. Boot. Auto select. Man, I can't believe the screen. Doesn't the screen look phenomenal? Usually when you get these, they're all faded. Like, you'll have these horrible white spots in it. I just can't believe the overall condition of this laptop. It just it blows me away, just the overall condition of it. Um, sorry about the filming, guys. I'm using my phone today to try to film this. Um, so, and I'm trying to be quiet too because I'm at work right now. But I got a few hours before my actual stuff starts, so I just burning a little bit of time here. Man, I'm not sure. What do you guys think I should do? Does anybody know what I should do? Like. Boot priority. Let's check out the boot priority. Enter. Enter doesn't work. Okay. Um, can I double tap on it? Well, I don't know. What's it want me to do? It won't let me change nothing. This is weird. You know what I would like to do? I would like to just oh look it changed it FDD CD HCDD HDD FCD ROM land that's what it was originally on let's see how do I exit escape you are exiting yes I bet the CMOS battery and it's probably bad I wouldn't doubt it Let's see here, what's it gonna do? Oh my God, it's actually loading Windows, no way! What? This is crazy. Oh my God, this computer is how old? 18 years old? And look at that, I bought I bought a self, or I bought a new charger for it. It's been plugged in for about 15 minutes, and look, boom, it is loading into Windows. That is insane. It even made the jingle. Oh my God, that is too crazy. Make sure to leave a like on this video. You guys definitely want to leave a like. Wow. I wonder if there's personal stuff in here. <laughs> Let's see. 
Let's go into the start menu. Uh huh. My documents. My pictures. Let's see. Hopefully there's nothing dirty. Well, maybe there is something dirty. That'd be kind of cool. Wow, look at the colors on that thing. Bro, it is vibrant as can be. Sample photos, pictures. Oh, man, there ain't nothing on it. It's been wiped. It's blank. It actually is pretty smooth, though. Wow. This is crazy, dude. I'm just blown away. I was expecting to have to tear this thing apart, buy more RAM, buy a new battery, do this, do that. This is crazy. See, I don't remember how to use Windows XP. Uh, shoot. Wow. My computer? Let's see what's in my computer. Mm, my document shared. Control panel. View system information. Okay, that's kind of cool. Let's see what that is. Oh, here we go. Windows XP Professional version 2002 service pack. Yeah, 2000. Let's see here, there's 496 megabyte of RAM. Oh, okay, so I have double the RAM than what comes with it. So this is definitely the, uh, the higher end model. I was definitely looking at that. Automatic updates, oh my god, I had to hook this thing to the internet. System restore, computer name, hardware. Wow, this is awesome. Wow, now I got something to play with. I think I should. I think I should absolutely do it. I should wipe that out, put Windows 10 on it, and use the dink. I don't think it will handle Windows 10. Can you imagine trying to put Chrome on this thing? It would go crash. That is so cool. Wow. All right, well, make sure to leave a like, guys. Uh, it was a satellite. It's a Toshiba Satellite A15S1271. That's the model number on it. Awesome. Leave a like, guys, and subscribe.